Brothers and sisters, we're here today in Berkeley to bring you a very special hummus, a beet hummus, organic, but of course, we start with garbanzo beans. Soak them overnight. Drain off the soak water, rinse them thoroughly, drain off the rinsing water, please, and then put the garbanzo beans in a pot, cover them with water, bring them to a boil, and simmer them for a half an hour. So we start with garbanzo beans, say about uh, 15 ounces or so. And here we go, we're going to put them into our food processor. Okay. And next we're going to be, we're going to, uh, uh, to add to the food processor a chopped beet. And now, half a cup of our, of our alive organic sesame tahini, created right here in Berkeley. So half a cup of tahini, an essential ingredient indeed. How, how brimming with nutrients it happens to be. So smooth, flowing, streaming, and delectable. And how about a heaping tablespoon of our living tree, alive organic almond butter. And another heaping tablespoon of our alive organic Walnut butter. Yeah. And what about a quarter cup of our Alive Organic California Farm uh, Olive Oil? Made by magnificent family farmers in the Central Valley. And how about a couple a couple cloves of garlic? Um, a teaspoon of cumin? A teaspoon of our um, of our Royal Himalayan Pink Crystal Salt and a teaspoon of paprika. Maybe add a bit of, of spring water to help things along. Appears to me it needs a bit more water. Last but not least, how about a uh, um, an entire Meyer lemon? Let's put this in here, an essential ingredient.
It's creamy smooth. It's vibrant. It's alive. It's organic. It has been our privilege to share this recipe with you. By all means, give it a try at your earliest opportunity. Here is health. Here is, here is nutrition. Here is vitality. All created from chickpeas, garbanzo beans, tahini, olive oil, lemon juice, garlic, cumin, Himalayan, Royal Himalayan Pink Crystal Salt, and paprika. Our privilege, our delight to share this with you. Your comments and suggestions are always so very, very welcome indeed. Let us go forward, my dear brothers and sisters. <laughs>